as a kid, I've always been really artsy. Um, I didn't think I was going to major in art in college. I thought I was going to go into um, pharmacy, which is crazy. I started my art account in, um, I think I was a sophomore in high school, just to post school projects and stuff. And then I got into writing calligraphy and that became really popular. Um, so that's, that's when I started doing commission work. I create um, acrylic paintings, sometimes drawing, sometimes digital work. Um, sometimes oil, kind of everything, but mostly acrylic paintings. So this is the laundry room slash my studio. Um, this is where I do all of my painting commissions, anything artsy, it's in here. This person wants it for Mother's Day and her mom likes, after the giveaways that I do, I get a ton of commissions um, and just praise and it's kind of, it's really cool just to see how many people want what I do. This is a very much of a trust the process kind of painting. <laughs> it looks like a child's doing it right now, but it all comes together. I get a lot from um, Chicago, Florida, North Carolina, um, Texas, kind of just around here uh, in the South a lot. Presley Page was a really cool experience. I had never been there before, which was kind of embarrassing, but um, it, was, it was something that I've never gotten to do before, was to actually exhibit my work and have people just come by it. I am having another pop-up shop that I'm very excited about. Um, it's at Sweet One on April 30th. I'll be probably doing the same kinds of things with the prints and maybe another painting if I have time, I don't know. I hope after I graduate that I can continue this. It makes me a little bit nervous just because working a full day, a full week, um, I'll be tired. <laughs> so um, I'm hoping that I can still do commissions, just maybe not as many as I do now. Um, yeah, I'm kind of just winding down, finishing up all my Fayetteville commissions here and then moving on to Little Rock.